Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get to the uh, next video, Dono. And don't get me wrong, hey, what I'll get to your last one here, but we got a lot of folks that uh, are in the mood, thanks to you. Uh, so let's go to Prolapse Pete here. And cheers to Prolapse Pete. He said, uh, hey there, Ghost. I hope your broadcast is going well. It's, you know, I did have some activation uh, videos a few months ago. But no worries, as I can find them for another show. Uh, but I did not come empty-handed. Here, uh, I did come with a rather bizarre video. You can watch while smoking tobacco. It's definitely similar to tool videos. Enjoy the hellscape. And cheers. All right, let's take a look at this. All right, oh, oh, dude, what? AI generated footage of your grandma. Come here oh and give God. me all some sugar. Dude, uh, prolapse Pete, dude. Wh why? Why? Whoa! Dude, prolapse Pete. What the fuck, despicable me? Holy shit. What the hell? Dude, AI's got some problems, dude. What the hell? I'm scared for my life. Wait, 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 whoa, is that John Cena? What the hell? What the hell? The granny's eating a, a corn dog? Granny's MMA fighting? Granny's rollerblading? Oh, she's skateboarding. My bad. Uh, Granny's got cats? What the hell? Dude, I'll be honest with you. AI... I, I, AI's kind of going nuts at this point in time. I, I think at this point, now that everybody knows that they can just shit out content with AI... And, by the way, AI is using the data collection from scouring the internet to comprise and and you know most of its answers and its knowledge base and i mean don't you think that you know in my opinion that ai is kind of maybe mind fucking itself because people are generating ai content and it's being put on the net and then ai is basically taking shit that it said and and, and it's like repeating itself I don't know. I just think that uh, AI has is, is gone a little awry, okay? And the reason I say that is because AI has been given restrictions. You know, ChatGPT, they got these, like, jailbreak type of scenarios that it's not supposed to go beyond a something, uh, beyond a certain parameters about cer subject matters. And if it does, it's, it's jailbreak, and they could ban your account or something if you say something or ask AI racist shit. Those boundaries, dare I say, are the ones that are now making ChatGPT, which, believe it or not, I had one of the first accounts on ChatGPT and interfaced with AI a lot. And it was because it gave accurate information until it decided, or at least the ChatGPT creators decided, to draw parameters around what AI can or can't go, you know, it can't go and answer certain data because of, I don't know, whatever, the wokeness or anti-racism or whatever the case might be, and it's affecting AI's answers. AI, at the beginning of ChatGPT's induction to the public, was 99, 98% accurate. Did you read that ChatGPT now is like 65 or 70% accurate now? And it's because of all the aggregated data that it has accumulated and also the parameters that many of these AI developers are giving AI. Once you give AI parameters, then it's no longer autonomously learning. They're literally fucking got anime asses shaking, for heaven's sake. Anyway, that was Gunter. Uh, that was his favorite song by Superjoint Ritual. And then he posted this one. He said, this is a short one. What is this? Put the PC show. What is this, Gunter? Upon closer examination, one can see how Bikini Bottom is an allegory for the destiny of Faustian Europe. What? Squidward clearly represents the Apollonian Aryan man. It's what? <laughs> full of the creative what? Hyperborean soul and solar aristocratic character. What? And yet there is a tragic aspect to his character and that his spiritual and creative passions are given no place in the degenerate modernistic kosher bacchanal that is modern crabs run bikini bottom. 
Oh SpongeBob my God. represents the Dionysian Are you aspect fucking of kidding Aryan me? culture. He is the unawakened Gentile who has. Hey, Derricking, are you listening to this? Cultural Marxist brainwash. Always maintaining a. Hey, handsome truth, are you listening to this? Get fawning and servile before the Semitic crustacean power structure. <laughs> Patrick represents the indoctrination of the primitive blood. Whoa! Into the formerly pure ethnos. Oh my god. Am he I listening is to this? This is. Un an unproductive anti social drain on society. Oh my god. And yet, the good SpongeBob has been conditioned to accept his friendship, unaware of how his own way post of life. Post the link? I'm not posting the link to this shit. Tonic subterranean elements. Oh my god, no. As I'm sure we're all aware. Well aware. Mr. Krabs represents the eternal himself. Oh my As god. Give me a fucking a break. Filthy money grubber. He's trying to make a living. One episode twelve. He's just trying to make a living. On the racially unaware SpongeBob, by trying to set him up on a date with his ball busting kid, uh, whale daughter Pearl. Oh my god! He can, yeah, he can't even stay in character. This time. fucking guy. He couldn't even stay in character. He's like, I can't believe I'm actually saying this. I'm a fucking tard. <laughs> Good God, Gunter, what the fuck was that, dude? What in the actual fuck was that? 